G'day guys, welcome back. So this is just a further two from the earlier video about my homemade kippers. Um, so just to give you a rundown of what we're doing today. Today we're going to be doing a traditional English breakfast with a food alchemist twist. So um, you may have seen me smoke these yellowtail to make my version of an Aussie kipper. This is the comparison here. So these are your traditional Scottish kippers. They're a smoked herring. Um, they're being cold smoked likewise with my yellowtail. And today's recipe, what it involves is basically, I'm going to be do, giving you a demonstration on a homemade hash brown, because that's what it's served with traditionally. And we'll be grilling both of these um, type of kippers up, just as a taste comparison as well. So I'm going to start um, preparing all the ingredients, and we'll check in when it's time to eat. So there you have it. So we just come in for a close up and um, I'll give you a rundown on what's what. So um, just over here is your two types of kippers. We've got um, the smoke herring and this is my version of uh, an Aussie kipper. I've just done a bit of um, mushrooms fried in butter with garlic and shallots. And this, as you would have seen in the earlier footage, that is your homemade hash brown. Don't they look lovely? 
golden, crispy. I'm just letting the oil drain a little bit. Also, this is just a batch of my homemade tartare sauce because I thought it would go lovely with um, what we're eating today. So I'm gonna dish it up and we'll have a quick taste. Oh, also, um, if you want an in-depth demonstration on how this was made, just check it out on the link above. It's from my earlier video with the uh, Southern Fried Catfish and it's quite sensational. Okay, so without further ado, let's go in for a taste. I'm just gonna dish it up on a lovely plate. So I'll go with a bit of herring. Oh, the meat just got a bit of a fail there, but that's all good. And uh, a bit of the yellow tail. Okay, so that's not quite as aesthetically pleasing, but uh, you get the gist. Push up a bit of mushroom there. Let's put a dollop of the tartare sauce on. Okay, so let's go in to see for the taste comparison. So I'm just going to go for a taste just without um, any of the condiments, just to um, compare it. This is a bit of the yellow tail there. And as I mentioned earlier before, this fish is very underrated. And um, after what's been done to it, it is quite sexy. Now let's see how, how it tastes. Mm. It's a lot firmer than the herring. However, the taste is almost identical in um, the brine that I've made. I'll go a bit of the herring. Mm. That's also sensational too, guys. They're not very far off from each other the way they taste. And just um, have a bit of the, the hash brown with the filled mushrooms and some tartar sauce there. Mm. So once again, guys, another sensational meal. And um, it's just coming on dinner time. So we've, um, Dinner just about ready. I think it's time to ring the dinner bell. Call the trips. Oi! Dinner, guys! So, um, for, as for now, I'm going to thoroughly enjoy, enjoy my dinner. And until the next video, bye for now.